on the subject of commodity, because mm -hmm. you mentioned that um, music has become a commodity, and if we understand that music is healing, is a is like a healing art, and it's become a commodity, what impact does that have on our society now? If it's now become a commodity and we've lost touch with the fact that this is a healing. Yeah, it's amazing the impact it, mm -hmm. that it has on society. Well, it creates sort of a uh, a sense among us that music now has to be about the thrill of a show and so um, every once in a while I get a chance to see my friends they show me oh look at this show you know look at uh, American Idol look at uh, America's Got Talent look at these shows and I realize that a lot of times you know th these people are looking they're judging and they're judging on how much of a show they get and so you know if somebody does something really powerful or really um, thrilling then it has um, a greater response from people so as a result um, music um, as a commodity has become so much geared toward uh, what kind of impact it has on people in a way to excite them um, or to create um, a stir to to grab their attention to create to, to create a, a sense that they must focus on what someone's doing. Mm -hmm. um, so artists are using any way they can to get attention now. You know, uh, there was a time period where agents were telling artists, rap artists, to go out and have a gun incident, you know, because it would focus attention on what they were doing. You know, anything to get eyes on what you're doing. Um, and uh, it's because it's a commodity now. So the more eyes on what you're doing, the more possibility that those people will purchase the commodity. Um, and as a result of that, uh, the concept of healing has become way forgotten about, you know. Um, and you realize that um, now with the use of technology, um, artists are able to use technology to create almost any sound they want. In fact, they no longer have to be able to, they no longer have to have skill. They can uh, create whatever they imagine through a little bit of effort and technology. Um, so with, with those things now, they can totally work on the idea of how to thrill and how to create an excitement, how to create a big bang. They can totally work on that because you have the technology to make it happen, and you have the uh, the, the the you know the need for uh, money to come in, resources to flow in. So with all these things, um, then they can go directly to that rather than actually going through the steps, because music is a practice. If you go into music, you're involved with a spiritual practice. You can't avoid that. If you go into music. You're involved with a spiritual practice, um, but you can short you can shortcut a lot of that spiritual practice by just taking a little technology here and there, and saying, I, "This is what I want to have happen to me. This is what I want to sound like," and you can make it happen. But imagine this: all those people out there who are out there using auto tune, they sound like Alvin and Chipmunks. How about all these people who are out there using auto tune? What if in their musical practice they had to learn how to sing? They had to learn how to sing really well. And then after they learned how to sing really well, they had to learn how to double their voice themselves. An octave higher. That's a spiritual practice. <laughs> That's a spiritual practice. And if you, if you did the spiritual practice to learn how to do that without the technology, then you had to take steps. You had to train. You had to learn things. On that path, you learned lessons. You got taught some valuable lessons on that path. So, and would you say that ability to sing that way in itself would bring about healing towards that person? Yes, and the practice, mm -hmm. the discipline mm -hmm. that it took, the discipline that it took to get there mm -hmm. would bring about healing and would give them very much a, 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 a knowledge and information on how to use that healing for other people. Mm -hmm. They would get that information. You know, um, it's not easy to do that, 
but it is easy to get auto tune into it. <laughs> it is easy to put on a drum machine and get auto tune yeah, yeah, yeah. and just start rambling in rhythms, you know, with auto tune and a drum machine.